so since last time, it's pretty much just been painting. We've done the entirety of the stairwell hallway and the entrance to the rooms upstairs. And obviously turned this room from dark green to king blue. And it's brightened this room up, which is good. Uh, I've also done the big main feature wall in the dining room. That's all set to go. But just painting, getting stuck in, doing, uh, doing the fiddly bits at the moment, which have to be done so we can move on with things a bit more over the next couple of weeks. Still about three and a half, four weeks away from opening. So we've actually got quite a lot of time still to get this stuff done. Still working on recruitment. Now we've got a full kitchen team, which is nice. Front of house still needs a bit of work. We had a uh, restaurant manager fall through that we thought was gonna come on board. So we're just working through that at the moment. We've got head chef Josh. Josh is downstairs at the moment cleaning the kitchen, which is a great first job. Needed a bit of love in that kitchen. It was looking pretty rough, so we're gonna Scrub the whole kitchen, put a good look of paint all over it, just so it's a nice fresh start for the whole new team. It's functional, which is the main thing, and we can just tidy it up a bit. Give it a fresh appearance, which kind of helps with mindset. It's also really good from a, having some ownership over the kitchen for Josh. He gets to, um, gets to be the first one in there. He gets to do the first deep clean, and from today onwards, he'll be able to demand of anyone else that sort of cleaning standard, I guess he be able to point out that he cleaned the, the whole bloody kitchen and that any little job is less than that. So I think it's, it's, it's really nice to have that as a head chef. I've been there before. And also realizing that being a chef is more than just cooking food. You've got to know about the business side of it. You've got to know about the things that go on behind the scenes. I think it really adds to your ability to cook high quality restaurant food by being able to see past just the food factor. So that's gonna be nice for him. And nice for me as well, um, obviously being a chef by trade, letting someone else take over that and do that is quite freeing. Um, obviously I can see what's happening, I know what's happening, I know what needs to be done. But really this is the, almost like cooking, this is the mise en place, this is putting everything in its place, making sure it's ready to go so we can really finish things up accurately and well in time for opening in the middle of October. So headed in about 5.30 this morning and hopefully out before midnight tonight. Have the kitchen operational sooner than I first thought. We can move testing recipes from the other restaurants to here 